This video will show you how to use the FP1 XLS paper drill. First, gather your materials, including your stack of paper, a compatible drill bit, a 3mm Allen wrench, a punch pad, and a flathead screwdriver. Now install the punch pad by snapping it into the divot with the peg pointing down. Next, install your drill bit by sliding it down into the guide and then up into the drill head until it hits the stop. Then tighten it with the Allen wrench. Now set your paper stops for your desired punch pattern and spacing using the screwdriver. Set the hole depth using the thumb screws near the back of the machine. Place your stack onto the table and slide the self-centering guides against the stack. Next, lift the handle on the left and slide the table all the way to the right. Let go of the handle and slide the table left until it hits the first paper stop. Now press down on the paper clamp. Pull down on the punching handle to punch your first hole. Lift the table handle and slide it left to pass over the paper stop, then release. Then slide the table left until you hit the second stop. Repeat this step to punch all of your holes. Now release the paper clamp and remove your stack to reveal your perfectly punched paper. It is as easy as that. With questions or for more information about the FP1 XLS, visit Binding101.com or call the number on your screen.